What's going on guys? Fatty Mancy checking in and on this video what I'm going to show you how to do is make a very easy um, go-to shake that, um, that I make when I feel like I'm not going to hit my protein or I'm really low on carbs and I get that, uh, that sweet urge. So this is going to be very quick, easy and uh, you need mineral ingredients. I'm going to give you some options along the way. But let's get started. So the ingredients you're going to need is uh, one cup of water uh, or milk, almond milk, ice, or sorry, almond milk, um, coconut milk, whatever you want to use. It's all going to depend on what your macros and what macros you're trying to hit. Uh, I'm going to make it just um, fairly low carb, pretty high protein, low fat. So I'm going to use water. So I got my... Uh, where is it? I got my um, blender on the scale already, and we're going to do 8 ounces of water. Alright, a little over 8 ounces. Got one cup of ice. Oh, missed that one. One cup of ice, and you could add more or less ice. I'm just going to kind of play with it, depending on how much of a slushy texture you want, or a smooth texture you want. Um, what I'm going to do is you can add peanut butter to this. Again, depending on your macros, I'm probably not going to add peanut butter because I'm going to save my fats for uh, a little bit later. You can add peanut butter on here. You add some creatine for your first morning shake or pre-workout shake. What I'm going to add next is um, about one uh, serving of blueberries. Just to give you guys an idea here, one serving of these blueberries is 12 grams, hold on. One serving of these blueberries is 12 grams of carbs. So again, very minimal. So we're gonna weigh this out. So I'm gonna be actually right under 12 grams of carbs. Uh, so, little quick trick. One serving is 140 grams, so I would divide the number here, 98 by 140, that's going to tell me how much uh, how much of a serving I have. So that's done. That's out the way. Uh, next question I know people are going to be asking me is, Fatty, can I use bananas? Can I use strawberries? Blue, uh, raspberries? You could use whatever fruit you want. Again, it's going to depend on your macronutrients. Um, I actually like to mix a banana in this and uh, tastes pretty good but I'm gonna keep it just real simple because you boys on a little bit of a cut so I'm trying to save my calories for later now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add uh, two scoops of I'm using uh, my proteins um, chocolate coconut protein so the macros on this are two grams of fat one gram of a carb and 20 grams of protein per scoop or 25 grams. Uh, I'm gonna actually measure it out. Okay. You can use whatever protein you want. If you do want to use this protein, um, it tastes pretty good. They, get, they have uh, really decent prices. I have made a Amazon store to make it nice and easy for you guys. Uh, so that link will be in the description. All right, so we're at 26. I'm trying to get to, what is it? 50 grams. Almost there. Fifty. Bam. All right, so I got, again, really simple recipe, guys. I did two scoops of protein. Uh, less than a serving of blueberries, ice, and water. Again, you can mix in milk. You can do what you want. I'll be right back. I'm going to blend this up, and I'm going to show you guys the finished product. Alright, guys. So here is the finished product. What I didn't show on camera is I added a little bit of the Cool Whip. Cool Whip. Uh, on top. I added three servings. So the total macros for this 
Um, and then I still got a bunch left over, as you see right there. So, <clears throat> excuse me, the total macros for this, about 17 grams of carbs. Uh, would have been 21 if I had a full serving of blueberries. 17 grams of carbs, about, uh, I want to say 7 grams of fat, and 36 grams of protein. So if you are a female and you are not hitting your protein, that's probably, um, you know, that's more than half or, uh, you know, maybe three quarters of the amount of protein that you're taking in a day, depending on, on your weight and your macros. Um, if you're a male, this could be a, a fourth of your protein. But basically, guys, what I'm trying to get at is there should not be an excuse as to why you're not getting your protein, why you're not hitting your macros. If you're bulking, if you need to eat more, lean bulk, whatever you want to call it. If you, didn't, if you need to eat more, you, you could ground some oats, throw it in there. You could add that peanut butter that I was going to do earlier. Um, you could add more fruits. You could even throw kale in there. Now, a warning, if you are going to throw kale in there, your smoothie is going to come out green, but it's tasteless. Anyways, guys, that is the finished product. I'm going to enjoy my shake, and I'll see you guys on the next video.